Oh, mum's going. Hang on. Are you sure? They said they're, I think they say they're going. Yeah. Hang on. Bye. We're still rolling. Oh. <laughs> G'day guys, so um, we thought today we would just do a little bit of a talk about uh, how the the dogs are really affecting people and how much joy they're bringing to people uh, who are our followers, you guys. Um, and you know, originally we just started this by sending out photos and, and uh, videos to our clients' owners directly and just to sort of say, yep, this is what your dog did at the farm. And, um, you know, we only had six dogs that would come and uh, it, was, it was a lot smaller. But as we grew, the numbers got a bit bigger. Uh, so we moved to social media um, and just told everyone to follow us and they can see, you know, all the, what their dogs got up to. Um, but then over the years, it kept growing. And, you know, we used to do a lot of photos, uh, but then the end of last year, we started getting into the videos and, and you know, just showing the action and all that. And um, it's it's grown quite significantly. Like every, we, we've got followers all around the world now and um, we just wanted to sort of take this time to, to let everyone know that, um, you know, there's a lot that goes on behind the scenes. We get a lot of people message us privately or send us uh, mail and, and tell us about how you know, they're, they're battling with their own um, world, whether it be, you know, from all, all sorts of things, depression, illness, um, and just how much the daily videos of seeing how happy these dogs are. G'day, Frankie. Um, you know, and, and what kind of difference it makes to their life and, and to their day. So uh, it, it really has sort of changed over the years from, you know, just sort of letting the owners know that their dogs had a good time to, um, you know we're we're quite flawed and overwhelmed. just overwhelmed with um, you know how much it is affecting people positively all around the world and um... <laughs> so we thought we'd share some of the stories. Some of them we can't share because they're quite personal, but um, we thought that we would share some of them and. Uh, let you know how big a difference the, the doggies and the videos are, are, you know, making in people's lives. So some of the stories that we've, we've been told um, include, uh, you know, people who have suffered, you know, long-term depression and they feel like the doggy videos are better than medication and therapy. Um, we've also heard from a, um, someone who runs a PTSD unit with the police force and how they um, show the doggy videos in, in the, the group and also encourage people to follow um, the farm and, and watch the videos for a little bit of, you know, light relief. Uh, we've also heard about... Um, a little a, girl in hospital. Yeah. A little girl in hospital who, um, you know, is battling cancer and uh, as a result of some of the treatment uh, suffered a stroke and uh, has, has ended up you know not being able to walk or talk or respond in any way um, and one of the nurses showed her a picture or a video of ours and um, she responded with a smile and it was the first time she made any um, you know movement at all and so the the nurse quickly asked her oh would you like to see another one and she responded with a nod um you know so those kind of stories you know they're they're really um they're sad stories but they they've got a bit of a um a lot there for some people around the world so it's it's something that Oh, I'm struggling for words yeah, here. I'm, we, I was getting a little bit choked up, but we, we could we just... never have imagined that um, you know that the doggies and the videos could make such a positive difference to people. Yeah. Um, you know, and we we do really like hearing how it's um, you know it's made a difference to people around the world, especially with COVID and and you know everyone going through their personal struggles, um, and it's it's turned into something that 
that's our objective behind these videos now is to bring that happiness out there and to you know share that happiness with anyone who's w willing to watch um, and we also wanted to say thank you to everyone for sharing you know the videos because we wouldn't have been able to reach yeah. you know, the people yeah, exactly. that it has reached without your help um, so thank you very much for sharing and commenting because all of those things um, you know get the get the videos out there organically and um, you know we we don't put any money behind it to, to promote it like it's all your um, power in in sharing the videos that has you know got it out to all these people around the world so thank you very much for that um. <laughs> But, uh, oh, what are we gonna say? Yeah. So uh, we've got a, a another um, box to open today from from fan mail, and um, you know we we don't show you these videos or we don't put these videos out there to try and you know generate people to send us anything or, or make people feel like they should send us anything. Um, the, these are packages from people who these videos have touched their lives and the and the dogs have made a difference in their lives uh, and this is just their way of saying thank you so um, I suppose we just wanted to um, put that out there that, that that's the the message behind this stuff um. Hi, <laughs> we got a okay, oh, okay. second. So today we're going to open a, a care package from uh, Debbie all the way over in uh, Canada and then also another one from uh, Annette from, from Victoria. So uh, let's go and see what it is, eh? That boy, what is it? Oh, and Tilly. It's Tilly's favourite as well. She loves it. Don't let them know that those little squeak. <laughs> what do you think, Zig Zig? <laughs> I mean it. What's going on there, guys? Wow. So we, we don't usually do this, but I'm going to read uh, the letter today. So it says, hi, Aunty Sam and Uncle Luke. Although I don't comment uh, on the posts on Facebook and Instagram pages, I confess I must be your biggest fan. Uh, it feels like I know every doggo personally. I love them all. Uh, with some favourites in brackets uh, and their antics. You have created the perfect doggy heaven. Uh, thank you for living the dream. Uh, so please accept my gift uh, for the pack, dog and human. The sweetest the bandits are giving is appreciation. Yeah. Uh, the sweet angels you, you have in your care. I wish all the best life has to offer. Sincerely, Annette. And Annette has very generously uh, given us a brand new lure machine. Um, so as you can see, bandit is stoked. <laughs> Someone's already grabbed the lure. Where's the lure gone? Someone's taken it. <laughs> but, um, you know, we're, we're just really, really floored with your generosity, uh, Annette. That's, you know, a, a very, you know, very big thank you to, to you from all of us here at the farm. Um, the, the lure gets an absolute workout at the farm. Oh, here it is. Someone's, <laughs> someone's grabbed it. The, the lure machine gets an absolute workout with these guys and it was really needed. The old one was uh, getting very tired, so a big thank you and we can't wait to break it out uh, and give it a good run tomorrow. Look at them, they're all, they're all keen, aren't they? Yeah, we'll see that tomorrow, guys. Oh, loving it. Bandit. What's in there, Frankie? What is in here, guys? I think this hey. one's a mix. This one's, there's a few things in here for, for us humans as well as the dogs. Like uh, some Canadian treats, some bugles. Can't wait. Love a good treat. Let me have a crack at this one. What flavour is it? Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> That's what flavour. Give it a go, mate. Good, <laughs> <laughs> Jason, get into that, mate. Some treats from Canada. Canada. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh. All right. I'm gonna go. Yeah. I'm gonna go the black one. That's it. We're on. I'll put this one down. Happy days. Oh, we got dog scarves and. All right. Who's gonna? 
Oh, oh shit. look how cute that is. Whoa. What is that? It oh, says, awesome. look, sweeter, sweeter than, than maple, sweeter than maple syrup. Cute. That must be for the girls. Excellent. Look at this. Ah, oh, the girls are going to go mad for this. Look at all this candy in here. Amazing. Oh, yep. I have to show them later. There we go. Some frisbees. Wow. Some Canadian oh. dog Some bandanas. Dog bandanas. All right. Look at this. <gasps> Chuck some of these on the dogs, boys. Oh, we've got we've got specifics here. This one's for Bandit. Bandit boy, this one's for you, mate. You got a different colour. Boy, this could be some favouritism here, maybe. I'm not sure. Come here, Bandit. Hey, hey. Come wow. Here, all right. Good boy, buddy. Good boy. Hold on, mate. Hold on. We're all getting dressed up here. Hold on, mate. There we go. Look at that, eh? Canadian bandana, eh? Perfect. Good boy, mate. Good boy. We've got some little doggy shirts and everything. Oh, that's so that. cute. Who's, who's small enough today for these? Little Taz. Taz. And 100% pure Canadian maple syrup. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, that's a good stuff right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, that is good. That is good. Canadian maple syrup. Oh, you want that one? Go. Oh, you want that one? Go. You want that one? Go. <laughs> good boy, mate. Good boy. <laughs> maple flavoured Cheerios. <laughs> That'll be my breakfast tomorrow morning. <laughs> All right. Crikey. Crikey, you want something, mate? Where's Arthur? Oh, that Arthur. One. We had specific instructions that uh, the puffer fish ball was for Arthur because he keeps skinning the balls. Oh, and Dash has got one already. How'd she get that one? <laughs> Arthur, this one's for you, mate. This one's for you, buddy. Oh, oh you ready? You ready, Arthur? You're Oh, I know what we'll be doing for uh, Arvo's today. Put these ones ready for this afternoon. Adam, I think this one's for you, mate. And you've got a little leg in there too. For my hot chocolates in the morning. There you go. Cool. Ripper. Bigger than one, the one I've got now. There we go, that one. That's a cracker. Oh yeah, oh look at these balls. There's some good ones, mate. There's some good ones. We'll get those out, won't we? Arthur will love that. Yeah, he will. He will. Arthur, Arthur, have a look at this one, mate. Ready, ready, go. We got afternoon snacks sorted, boys. Hickory sticks, chocolate, Smarties. Look at this Thanks very much. This is amazing, an unbelievable gift from uh, all the way from Canada from uh, Debbie. So thank you very much, really appreciate it. The girls can't wait to see this one. Look at this little box of treats in here. Bandit, look at you, mate, you look smart. Hey, your new Canadian outfit. Hey. <laughs> He's a smart lad, this one. And you, buddy. Looking sharp. Good boy, Josh. Come on, buddy, let's go. 